Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will be completing the Stick Bug Quest. The Stick Bugs Nymph Hats Quest. So let's get right into this YouTube video. So I just have to catch one falling coconut. That's what I left for the quest. So here we go. Three, two, one. There it is, guys. Boom, we're done. Finally. Stick bugs, nymph hats. It's ready for stick bug. Yes. I've been working on this quest for a very long time, and it's finally time to turn it in after all that time. It's a lot. <laughs> and I know he starts the stick bug challenge too, so yes. 50 billion honey. Ten, five gingerbread bears. Uh, 50 tickets. 250 gingerbread bears. Sorry, 250 bitter berries. 10 stingers. 10 tropical drinks. That's insane. Now I'm like, wow. That's the most honey I've ever had at one time by so much. Time to claim the. Um, I'm trying to remember what present this was. I think it's like the 10th present or something. Whatever this one is, it's this, like this parkour here. Once we do this parkour, uh, 11th present. Yeah. Open the purple box. Here we go. Here we go, guys. We're doing it. We're opening the purple box. Ooh, a mythic egg. Yes, guys. Mythic egg. That looks very beautiful there. Okay, we got a mythic egg, 10 blue extracts, 10 purple potions, 15 ginger peppers, and 10 red extracts. What? That was the. Uh, that was insane. Wow. Got two mythic eggs now. That's pretty insane. That's a lot of purple potions. I haven't been able to afford to craft them because. Uh, the. Uh, oh, like, I haven't been able to afford to craft them because of the. Uh, where is it? The mat. Like, the. Oh, what were those things called? Neon berries. There, sorry. Neon berries. Yes, and I actually want to see what the festive nymphs do. I don't know if you have to activate them. So, since you did start the stick book challenge already, we're going to be very late into it, unfortunately. Two, one and a half minutes. It's okay. Don't worry. Like, that's... I'm not planning on getting a good score on this. I'm just planning on checking things out for this. And also, guys, this is my 100th video. Yes. The nymphs are pleased with their hats. Now, festive nymphs may spawn during the challenges you start. Yay. That's pretty exciting. So yeah, this is my 100th YouTube video too. So this is like the 100 YouTube video special. It's completing the stick bug challenge or like the stick bug quest. And it was actually really hard for me to complete, to be honest. It took a very long time. The amount of pollen I had to get was pretty intense. It was harder than, even harder than like the 30th spirit bear quest. I really want to complete the gummy bear quest, but I don't know. It's, it's really intense. That last, last part there. Probably won't be able to complete that one, but it's okay. Here we go. So we're gonna go and see up here and see what the festive nymphs look like and are. Like, I know what they look like, but like, see like how OP they really are. Kill the werewolf there. Yeah, that present was insane. Festive nymph. I just saw a festive nymph. Ten pineapples and stuff. Oh, look at that blessing! 2,000 capacity, uh, what, plus 1% instant bee gather conversion, plus 1% honey per pollen, plus 1% bee, bee attack. Eight hours long? Oh my gosh, that's a really long one. Wow. And that was from killing two festive nymphs. Two. Like, I just walked in there. I, I happened to just walk in there right at the perfect time. Dude, they give insane rewards. And also, guys, they can do... A diamond egg, yes, diamond egg, and festive sprouts. Festive sprouts are very crucial to doing extremely amazing boosts. So you really want those to grind that stick bug. The stick bug is very important right now. You want to grind him. And I don't think anyone else can see my festive nymphs because if they don't have it unlocked, but yeah. That's really OP. I mean, that's insane. And they can drop other really insane rewards. I know they drop neon berries a lot, so that's going to help me a lot. Because I can't afford purple potions because I did too many boosts. I want to say that. I mean, technically, there's no such thing as too many boosts. But I did do a couple too many boosts, and now I don't have any purple potions. It's kind of sad. So, yeah, we're just going to check out these festive nymphs. Oh, I just got another festive blessing thing. It, adds, it just adds on more. Like, it adds on another thousand capacity. Which can, which really um, turns out to be a decent amount when you get that to be like 100 times or something. So yeah, I think festive nymphs are not too rare when you unlock it. See, is that that's a festive nymph? Oh, and it dropped a micro converter and one of those festive hat things. A, a micro converter. They drop micro converters, guys. That's really important for boosting. 
Just summon that stick bug challenge, you get micro converters from it. I mean, that's OP. That is overpowered, guys. See, stick. Now grinding the stick bug will really help you. Uh, Cause I mean, coconut crab gives you the most out of everything. So once you kill him, you do a mega burst. You run out of micro converters, then you can kill a stick bug a couple times, and then you add 15 micro converters again. See, it's super OP. Like, look at that festive nip right there. Let's see, what is he gonna give? A micro converter and some other good stuff. See, another micro converter. Nip. This is really easy. Oh, and an oil. Look at that. These rewards are godly. Festive nips give it so good rewards. Like, these rewards are just insane. And no one else can see my festive nymphs, because like, they're your own festive nymphs. I know that. So we want these stick bugs to, ch to spawn, so we can just keep on getting this blessing. And yeah, it's going good. It's, it's a pretty good blessing here. It's going to really help me, especially with fighting. Yeah, that's really exciting. The festive nymphs are overpowered. They're really OP. I started with, like, two micro converters. Now I've got five, so I already got three. And I, I've only been, I've not even really been doing the stick bug challenge because I came in very late. Because remember, I got the, like, the present and all that. Yeah, but 50 billion honey is gonna seriously help me quite a bit here. And yeah, I, I got, I have so many purple potions now. That's really exciting. But super smoothies, I really wish I could get tons of super smoothies and purple potions somehow. Like, really, just easy. And what did he drop? Anything good? A ton of pineapples. No, he didn't actually drop that many. Oh, there's the blessing right there. Yeah, he dropped that blessing. The festive nymph blessing is overpowered. It lasts for eight hours too, so like, that's a pretty long time. And it just, it goes up after, oh, he's got the sports, like, the uh, shooting stars, creep star. Yeah, it goes up to back to an, uh, eight hours every time you collect one. So you can just, as long as you kill one festive nymph every before eight hours then you will the blessing will keep going and going and going never run out it's gonna be it's op that's insane yeah this is really exciting festive nymphs are omega like seriously stick bug challenge is almost over but stick nymphs like uh festive nymphs drop very good rewards i mean they don't spawn too too often but i've killed eight already this run so i think that's pretty good so yeah, that, that's really, really good. So you really want to get unlock that 11th present, guys. It's super OP. But there's a 12th present that drops insane things up there. Or no, 14th present, unfortunately. I'm not going to be able to unlock that, but here we go. Let's see. What is he going to drop? Oh, uh, nothing good. Really, some snowflakes, 10 pineapples. Occasionally, they don't drop good things, but they can drop diamond eggs. So, yes. And uh, Fester's beans, which are the best. Oh, a gingerbread bear. Yeah, he dropped a gingerbread bear. See, that is crucial right there. That is crucial. Those gingerbread bears are crucial. You want those gingerbread bears really bad. And now Monotrick is in here. That's not going to help at all. So, yeah, now you've got a, a really, like, you really want to kill these festive nymphs now. So, they're stick nymphs and, or whatever, like, festive nymphs are not useful. Obviously. Like, now you've got a use for not killing stick bug because he spawns those festive nymphs. Like, just keep him, like, in the field, not dead. Like, if you don't want to get, if you, if you just want to grind festive nymphs, then just don't kill stick bug and just, oh, look, two more. Two more festive, three more festive nymphs, actually. Wait, I, he might be able to see these. I don't know. The festive nymphs? Oh, wow, this is insane. We're doing real good here. We're getting really OP rewards right now for these festive nymphs. Oh, and another micro converter. Yeah, that, that's crazy. Oh, Mondo Trick is really causing problems. Oh, another Festive Nymph Blessing. These things are really OP. We've already got 16 Festive Nymph Blessing things. Now 17, 18, 19. 19 and one stick bug for now already. Wow, that's OP. Oh, look, there's even more. Wow, 21 of them. Wow, they, they can also get... They're giving pretty decent rewards to a gingerbread bear from a from one of those. That's going to really help me, because then I can spend my gingerbread bears on things before Beast of Sands, you know. Yes. These gingerbread bears are very crucial here to Beast of He's finally almost dead after all this time. He's dying. Yes. 
And they do give a lot of honey, too. I mean, not, like, not that much, but, like, enough, like, for, like, people who, like, are noobs. That'd be a lot. Even though they, unfortunately, wouldn't be able to complete the quest. Because you can't get the quest. Oh, a neon berry. Yes. Or, I, I th like, you need to give the, it the translator to be able to, like, do the quest. Ah, uh, I want to get those festive blessing things. No. I died. But we got 25 of them. Oh, it went up plus 2% instant B gather conversion. That's really good. Okay, let's see. So we got new bronze here, but that's insane. Yeah, that's a new stink bug amulet, but let's see. What did we really get from this thing? Like, we got a whole four micro converters, serious stuff here. You can get a festive bean. Got some neon berries. Got like.